In this video, we'll cover features found in voltage supervisors. Voltage supervisors are commonly used in designs to integrate common features such as threshold detection, adjustable timing, and hysteresis. Integrated threshold detection allows you to save board space while monitoring voltage rails for overvoltage or undervoltage conditions. Adjustable timing is provided by configurable sense and reset delays. Configurable sense delays provide glitch immunity from transients to prevent false reset triggers, and configurable reset delays provide a defined output state to ensure system reset and startup sequencing. Hysteresis has built-in glitch immunity to maintain reset signal integrity by providing a buffer to the voltage threshold so the reset signal does not release prematurely. These are the typical features you would find in a traditional supervisor. On the next slide, we'll cover more advanced features that TI is investing in for the next generation of supervisors. New advanced features that our voltage supervisors have include vSense, built-in self-test, and latch outputs. vSense is a scaled-down voltage of the high-voltage sense pin input for real-time measurement with low-voltage processors. vSense is intended to be used with an ADC to give the system voltage telemetry data for control system and for redundancy and voltage monitoring. BIST is a diagnostic test that verifies the health of the device through internal fault injection to verify functionality without the need of external circuitry. This streamlines external diagnostics, enhances reliability, reducing board space while saving time and resources for engineers. Latch output keeps the reset asserted even after fault recovery on the sense pin. Keeping the reset pin asserted after fault helps avoid unnecessary power cycling to prevent system damage. Thanks for watching. For any questions, please post on TI's E2E forum at e2e.ti.com. To learn more, visit ti.com/supervisors.